The ICA Research Sales and Marketing Program 2014 welcomed over 140 delegates from more than 40 countries. And I spoke to one about a fascinating hotel, entertainment and events complex in South Africa. So, Tanya, um, you really exemplify the international flavour of this event. So, tell us where you're from and tell us about your organisation. Uh, well, I'm from South Africa. Uh, the company that I work for is Empress Palace uh, Casino and Resorts. It's, why, it's well, the flagship venue and a portfolio of 14 properties. But um, what we want to do with ICA is actually get more exposure. Uh, I think there's a lot of competition in South Africa. Um, our venue is five minutes from our Tambo International Airport. So uh, from an access point of view for internationals, it's really ideally located. It's got four hotels, a five-star, four-star and two three-star hotels. Gives us about 672 beds on complex and then conference facilities from eight to 3,000 delegates, uh, which makes it a perfect destination. Um, the access is very important. Security for a lot of people travelling to Johannesburg is a concern, which the resort offers because it's um, fenced off and access controlled. And uh, it offers 16 restaurants on complex, uh, cinemas, live shows, and also a casino floor for those interested in, in gaming. So it's really a one-stop shop for the international market and um, also very nicely located for pre- and post-tours because you don't just sell your venue, you also sell your country and the destination and the possibilities for, for conference delegates. Uh, considering it's a long-haul flight, I think... It's one of the aspects that we do need to focus on a little bit more in selling um, our venue as a conference facility. That's really interesting. You really have. Like you're a one-stop entertainment stroke conference exactly. palace, aren't you, really? Exactly. Hence the name, I suppose. Exactly. But, um, you know, you're here at, at RSMP, and um, uh, what is your, your, your main focus? You know, what are you hoping to learn most from this week? I think it's the diversity and uh, these little uh, nodes of knowledge and experience that other destinations and venues have. And having the access to that variety and the opportunity to select um, that aspects that match your key focus areas, I think that exposure is invaluable here, um, as well as the database training and how to utilise it specifically for your requirements. Uh, I think, for instance, especially in Selling Africa, um, sometimes it's limited with associations, a lot of it is focused to the European uh, continent and there's a lot more variables that you have to consider when you sell an African conference destination. Um, very important is obviously uh, the originating countries the delegates are from, uh, the content of the conference, uh, the accessibility obviously because it's a long haul destination and therefore we mostly secure more longer term conferencing there. From the Southern Africa uh, region, obviously shorter conference because of the flight time and access, but I think what's important from this workshop is just that um, exchange of information. I think it's a two-way street. You, uh, you might have a comment or a concern that might be applicable to someone in Iceland, for instance, even though you're based in Africa, and I think that's one of the nice things about attending the event.